Hi. Welcome to Love and Forever Evolving, where we are always and forever evolving. Hello, Gemini. Welcome back, Gems. Welcome to your general love reading. I hope all has been well, Twinkies. Hope you've been taking care of yourselves. Yes, as always, shout out to the beautiful soul family as well. Thank you all so much for your continuous love and support. Welcome back to my subscribers. Thank you all as well for your love. It is always appreciated, all right? And welcome to the ones that are new here, Gemini. Thank you all so much for sharing your time with me today. Definitely, if today's content fulfills your spirit, don't forget to like and subscribe as well. We would love to have you here, part of our soul family. And definitely come and check me out when I go live on this channel for all 12 signs and love live stream questions, all right? If you have a question that you would love to ask Tarot, all the email details are down below in the description box as well, okay? So no further ado, gems. Let's go ahead and dive into your general love reading. We're going to see about this person here today that's on your mind. We're going to see who is in your energy and why are they in your energy, how they feel about you. So we're going to first start out with some love, romance, angel energy here to see what suggestions do they have for you when it comes to your love life or what's next to come. All right. So definitely take your what resonates for you, gems, and leave here on the table what does not. Okay. Ooh, we got flirt here, gems. Okay. Extend your like-hearted energy to others. All right. So there could be someone around in your energy that you're flirting with. You're getting to know here. This could be someone new. All right, or just someone that you're currently dating here. And a lot of flirtatious energy is going on in this connection with you two here. All right, let's see what else. What else is going on in Gemini placements? Love life here. What else do they need to know at this time? What else is coming around for Gemini when it comes to love and romance here? Okay. Ooh, yeah. Very soon, okay? We have clearly decide what you want so that it comes to you now, gems, okay? So some of y'all, you may have a decision here to make. You may definitely or communicating or connecting, excuse me, with someone here new. Um, others of you all, you may be indecisive about you and someone else here, okay? There could be more than one person here in the picture and you're needing to very much so decide very soon here who is it going to be, okay? Wow, let's get one more card to your gems. My, my, my. Some of y'all are definitely engaging with someone new here, all right? Others of you all could be in a situation where you are connecting with more than one person. You're trying to get a feel of who's going to be the person for you, and you're needing to decide very soon because I feel like there's a heart-to-heart -heart conversation. Yep, look at that. As soon as I said that. There's a heart-to-heart -heart conversation. Honestly, discuss your feelings with each other. So, yeah, there are two different energies, two different people here. You may still be connecting with someone from your past that you are exchanging energies with or kind of still maybe be intimate with from time to time. And then I feel like you maybe kind of put this person to the side because they maybe didn't know exactly what it is that they wanted to do with the connection with you. So you may be starting dating someone new and connecting with someone new here. And I feel like the more this connection may be getting stronger than what you thought, this is why Spirit is suggesting to make a decision very soon, okay? Before things become a little chaos here, okay? We got here, yeah, look at that. Give your relationship a chance. Work on your partnership. Some of y'all, there is actually still hope for the connection that you're currently in, okay? I just feel like, again, that a heart-to-heart -heart conversation here is needed to be had here, okay? Communication needs to be communicated here between you two in order to get a better understanding, I feel like, of where each other is at or how each other are feeling at this time. Wow, yep, because you got true love here as well with this other person over here for some of you all that you're connecting here with. This is the romance of a lifetime, okay? Wow. So there's definitely a romance of a lifetime or an opportunity here. That's kind of like a needle in the haystack, you know what I'm saying? That's something that you lucked up on, okay? This is not the typical, this connection over here with whoever is connecting with this new person and flirting and re realizing the connection is being very enlightening here. 
this is someone that um, you didn't expect coming your way. You didn't expect that things would go this far between you two and this person and connect with this person like this. And there it was definitely a connection of a chemistry connection between you two. But there's going to definitely have to be a decision here made, okay? Because there is someone else here in the picture. So some of y'all might need to close one chapter, close one door before you go into this new chapter here. Yeah, look at that. We got pay attention to the red flags. The signs are cautioning you. So there could definitely be someone in your energy that is not being as genuine as you would imagine for this person to be. All right. Um, there could be an elephant in the room that needs to be addressed here. All right, and you're needing to pay attention to those red flags, Gemini. All right, wow. So let's see what's going on here. Let's clarify the heart-to-heart -heart conversation here. Because I definitely see that there's two different situations. There's two different connections. Some of y'all may be separated with the person here that you may be having a difficulty communicating with or being on the same page here with so you end up meeting someone new here in the mix of why this is on hold over here and this is why i mentioned that some of y'all didn't realize that the person over here that you're connecting with you are gaining feelings for and this person is gaining feelings for you so let's see why do we have a heart to heart conversation here for gemini Wow, Gems, definitely at the reading here so far is resonating for you. Smash that like button, loves, all right? Why do we have heart-to-heart -heart conversation? The Four of Swords. Yeah, I see you kind of plotting, thinking, meditating, um, Gems, on this person here to see if this is something that you want to continue in the near future. This person could be an air sign like yourself. They could be a Libra, Aquarius, or a Gemini here. All right, let's see why do we have give your relationship a chance here. Why do we have give your relationship a chance here for gems? Why do we have give your relationship a chance? Wow, the page of pentacles. Yep, you definitely have a new offer coming in here as well. This could be an earth sign, a Taurus, a Capricorn, a Virgo that's over here. Okay, let's clarify that very soon. Clearly decide what you want. Let's see what it is and why you're needing to decide very soon here. I feel like you're definitely stuck in between two different situations here for some of you all. The six of wands. Yeah, you're getting a lot of attention here with this connection <laughs> with this new person here. They could be a Leo or they could be a fire sign here, Gemini. They could be, I'm hearing Aquarius as well. Some of y'all, this person could be Aquarius, a Leo, a Sagittarius, or an Aries here, okay? And then we have the high priestess, Pisces energy here. Yeah, some of y'all, you're definitely aware of what's going on here, and so are they. Some of y'all, this new person that you're connecting with, they are aware that you are um, in the mix of an ex here or someone that you may be just, again, separated from temporarily, and they are aware of that. I feel like some of y'all have made aware to this person that you are still currently in a relationship or dating someone else here for some of you all. Clarify, pay attention to the red flags here. Why do we have pay attention here to the red flags for Gemini? Why do we have pay attention to the red flags? Wow, the full card. So whoever this person here is that wants to take a leap of faith with you, the person that you are connecting here with, um, the ex, there is something about this person that you're needing to pay attention to the red flags here. Yeah, the two of cups. I feel like that there is definitely a connection here between you and this person, but I feel like you just don't trust this person here. Why is Gemini needing to pay attention to the red flags? They could also be a Cancer, a Pisces, or a Scorpio. Yeah, you're having to set boundaries with this person here. Again, they could be Aquarius, a Gemini, or a Taurus here. Mm -hmm. Some of y'all, because you may, this person may be married. Yep. You had to walk away from this situation. This person hurt you. So this is definitely the energy where you are needing to have that heart-to-heart -heart conversation with that person. And if things can't be, you know, resolved, then this is where you're going to have to make a decision here very soon, all right, to move forward here and connect with this new person if that's something that you're willing to do. Again, they could be a Libra, Aquarius, a Gemini like yourself, okay? Um, they could also be... Uh, an air sign or a fire sign here as well. 
Wow, let's see what this person wants to say. Let's see how do they feel here regarding everything that has happened here between you two. Wow, we have this hurts my soul, Jims. Okay, wow, interesting here. This person I now I feel like is starting to be impacted here just as much as you was at first when it came to this connection here. Yeah, look at that. I'm healing for you. And now they're trying to find the time to remove the negativity, remove the feelings or emotions that they have for you. Try to put their feelings to a side and not think so negative about this situation because you two have decided to separate yourselves from each other. Yeah, look at that. I don't want nobody else, okay? Wow, yeah, this person definitely doesn't want... It's like now that you have decided to kind of pour your energy back, I feel like, Jims, now they don't want you to do that. Now they don't want you to, you know, stop whatever it is that you've been doing or giving whatever attention that you've been giving towards this person here. Now they miss that. Now they want that back. Wow, I'm walking away. I feel like some of y'all have decided to walk away from this person here. You're no longer wanting to engage or exchange energies with this person. You've tried to give this person here, I feel like, a chance, but they just didn't want to respect your wishes here. You know, yeah, look at that. I'm getting my life together. So it's like now they're trying to do the right thing here. Now they're wanting to try to rekindle with you and work things out. But like I said, I feel like some of you all have moved on. You've met someone new here, okay? Wow, Gems. I'm going to leave this portion of the reading here. Um, however, if you would love to book a personal reading to kind of get more insight, more details, to see what's the potential outcome here or just what's next in love for you, Gems, my email details are down below, loves, in the description box. Thank you all so much for tuning in today. Definitely, if you're new, again, don't forget to like, subscribe here. And definitely come and check us out on Patreon, Gems, if you would love more content from the channel. If you would love to get early access to my content, free live stream questions for my Patreon family, definitely come and sign up and check us out. I would love to meet you there as well, Gems. Thank you so much. And I definitely wish you and this person here the best, my loves. Bye-bye.